Hey there everybody, it's me, Sneaky Picnic, as always, here on the Minecraft Week Lock. Yeah, we're starting off in this uh, red mountain biome. As you can see, we have uh, sort of paths going around here. Give me a sec, give me a sec, I need to climb up. So. The idea, we are going to add like glass shards uh, here and there to make it look more fantasy, more magical. And paths are here because we are going to build just a few little houses on top of this mountain to create like a magical village. That's where creative mode comes to play. Here, this is what I want to show you. So I've been experimenting a little bit and I've got three small houses one big house that kind of looks uh, like a town hall maybe and then this one kind of looks uh, like a church a fantasy church i also created these red cactuses using mushroom blocks and also this lamppost but there's one problem i'm out of blackstone so first thing we need to do is a piglin bartering system and we need to trade for blackstone because I am done mining blackstone manually. Okay, so this is what it looks like right now. Yes, we've ha we have oopsies. Uh, we have some cactuses. I'm really proud of them. <laughs> we have some small, you know, just like two blocks, and then we have some big ones, which I I really love, and I want more of these. Look, it's like ten blocks high or something. Uh, yes, we have few of them, uh, quite a few, I would say, but important to know, this is not done, this is not finished, this is not a final product, this is just first few minutes of detailing. Let's, let's, uh, let's follow the path. I mean, you can already see what I was talking about. As you can see, we've got these uh, crystals, these magical crystals, of course, then we have this amazing lamp design as you saw in the creative world I love it and a few more lamp posts few more crystals and a few more houses so yeah it's very tiny house very 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 tiny but I love it nonetheless a uh, few paths here I actually have some slabs and stairs so here you can actually walk up the hill and stuff like that I also detailed a little bit this area this village as you can see we've got the nether world then quartz beautiful flowers two big buildings and they were next to each other and logically I would say the church needs to be bigger than that one but that one <laughs> kind of looks bigger so i decided to make a tower up on the top ah, i think it kind of looks good with the, with those with those uh, spikes on the top on the corners using a blackstone wall i think it looks good i really like it so uh, still we still need uh, a few little tweaks and details and <laughs> red nether bricks so this is where this project is at right now uh, I think I'm not gonna add any more buildings I love it as is right now but what I want to do is add more details like for example the gold ore slab for example like this and then do I have any slab no 
but imagine I put slab on top of this block so it looks like it's flat surface then you waterlock the slab and then you can put coral coral from the water you can put it on top of the slab and because it's waterlock it will stay the color uh, yeah and more crystals of course we need more crystals uh, that's what I've been doing this last week and as I said I didn't have much time I'm sorry uh, but I think I still did quite a lot of progress I mean we have one <laughs> basically one new village built and now we just need to detail and I think I want to do some uh, some 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 uh, interior as well uh, but that we'll see in the next episode Okay guys, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and consider subscribing. Yeah, guys, have a great day. See ya. Bye.